Here at Simply Garden, with over 50 years of gardening experience, I believe in keeping things simple and productive while gardening in your own backyard. Here going. All right, so we're gonna do some pea picking here. And uh, should we do that? So I'm gonna run down the other side here. I do have some weeds in here, but you know what? At this point, I don't care because these are almost done. And then what the plan here is, we've got the acorn squash running down along the middle here. Beans coming along over here. Hi bees, yes, I know you still smell the, the honey that I probably got on my fingers from being in the beehive earlier. And then as soon as these are done, we're gonna rip these out and we're gonna plant probably about a half, uh, probably a half dozen or more broccoli plants along here. And then also we'll interplant those with lettuce, which is growing right over here, waiting to be transplanted. In fact, I may just go ahead and transplant those out and put them into some um, little three by th or four by four inch pots just to hold them over while I'm waiting for this area to free up. And there she is, she's, she's stealing more peas again. And I'm gonna jump here. I'm actually thinking, Jen, the front bed's probably gonna be more ready, but it, you know it, I what? mean, there are some in the back, yeah, some, that yep. caught up pretty quickly. Yeah, once it got humid, it's about 72 degrees today, beautiful breeze. We got a little tiny bit of rain today. Boy, we need a lot, we need a lot more rain. The problem with picking peas you gotta be careful about is the hollow stems. So you really wanna, you know, you gotta be gentle when you get in there. Uh, but as the season comes along, I get a little more rougher because uh, I know they're almost done. And, and they, they, they tend to break easily. Plus, we don't have our golden retriever this year who used to love come down here and help herself. She literally just walk right into the peas, stick her nose in there. She could smell those peas and just rip them off with her head and her teeth and just chew the whole thing right up. Those are beautiful looking. Let me tell you, I gotta try one. Hold, a a second here. Hold on here, hold on here. Oh yeah, huh? Amazing how big they've gotten already. I know, Dad. Mmm. Oh, that's just heavenly. Oh my goodness. <laughs> Nothing like steamed peas with fresh butter, really good creamy butter, pure butter. It's got to be pure butter, none, none of this, um, this, 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 it's got to be good. I know, I know. <laughs> For those who can't have it, I understand. But anyways, you, you need some butter with salt and pepper in there and you're, and you're good to go. Okay, I'm going to do this for, for carnival sin of stepping in my garden bed to get over here. But... Um, I All should. the years you got after us. I know, but I, these <laughs> things grew so big I can't reach over the side and without damaging the, uh, the vines. I know. I should probably, you know what I'm going to do? Hold on here. Fix the problem. I'm going to get a board. And it'll, <laughs> it's still no, it'll, it'll span my weight. <laughs> that way it won't pack the soil down. Always thinking, right? There we go. Put the, put the board in the, in the aisle. And that way... I can step in there, but I won't pack the soil down. Oh, these are just, my goodness, I can't imagine what tomorrow is going to bring. Yeah, we're going to be busy here. Then we got uh, nine more rolls of peas to pick oh, over. Oh, uh, so wonderful. Yeah, well, you, I promise you peas for you and your kids and anybody else who wants peas, come along and have them. Um, they're a lot of work, though. He's joking. He doesn't yeah. share his peas with anyone else. <laughs> <laughs> there we go. These are looking pretty good. Yeah, it's all organic. These are Lincoln variety. Um, got them from, um, sure, not Henry Fields, I'm sorry, but I got them from um, Harris Seed Company, which is now called Garden Trends. And um, they changed their name for reasons I don't know why, but that's okay. They're called Garden Trends. And uh, next year when we do the, our seed order, we'll probably put a link to it next year. Okay, we're going to keep picking keep here. Keep picking, so enjoyed uh, talking to you all, and have a great night. And uh, if you like what you see, thank you for subscribing.